Hi, this is Amanda Cantu for the Lone Star Conference. Thank you for joining us today. We're here with Cameron University's freshman volleyball player, Megan Olivares, as part of Cameron Week. Megan, thank you for joining us today. First, I want to congratulate you on being named Lone Star Conference Offensive Player of the Week last week. You had quite a couple matches with 24 kills and 18 digs against Texas Women's University, as well as hitting at a 37 percentage. It was just a good all-around week for you. Please give us some of your comments on your performance. Uh, well, this past week we played Texas Women's, and it was one of the it was one of the highlights of our season, I think, as we really came together as a team and uh, with with the support of my teammates, I think this is how that's how I achieved my award. And also with the help of the coaching staff, they really um, pushed for this last this last game. You're a true freshman coming to Cameron from high school. What has been your biggest challenge in making the transition to the college game? Um, I think one of the challenge, the biggest challenge is the intensity of the game and how the transition from playing in the high school level to the college level really is a big, big change and a big difference in the in the actual play. So um, coming in and being a freshman is is kind of most of the challenge. What do you see as the future for the Aggie volleyball program? Um, hopefully, we finish the season out great and. Um, we have a really young team, so hopefully some of the girls come back next year and we can be bigger and better than ever. Tell us about one of the community service projects you and your team have been involved in this year. Uh, some of the teammates, some of my teammates have come uh, with the Make-A-Wish Foundation and we're really involved in that. We bring around a, can a jar and we try to collect as many pennies as possible to donate to the foundation. Earlier this season, Aggie Volleyball hosted a Breast Cancer Awareness Night. Tell us what it was like to play in the gym that was filled with pink. It was, it was quite overwhelming. Um, as a player and as our, team, as our team goes, playing with those breast cancer shirts on and seeing our fans in the stand with just, it's like a sea of pink in the stands. Uh, it was very, very overwhelming, and uh, to know that we were fighting for such a great cause, and to know that that was one of our biggest games of the season, um, there was so many fans there, and I think that's why they showed up, because they wanted to support the breast cancer, and it just felt really good to play for the cause. Do you have any closing comments? Um, I just finish out, I hope we finish out this season with a bang, and we have two matches left. So I just want to know, I just want to thank the fans for coming out and supporting our team and hopefully we finish the season out great. Thank you, Megan, and good luck on the rest of the season. Be sure to check back tomorrow as Aggie Week continues with fellow volleyball player Amber Schroer.